Okay, so since we have a lot of things cleared out for the middle of the scene quest line stuff with my mare, I'm gonna go ahead and start this one. Ah, it's Traveler and Paimon, the bringers of exotic flowers. Oh, this is the girl who we helped with flowers earlier. Hello, Kosazana. Have the flowers we brought been growing well? Um, about that. I haven't gone to look at them for a whole day. Eh? Didn't you like the flowers? Why aren't you looking after them? Oh, they were so hard to get, so I don't want to take good care of them so, so much. But when I think that they might wither before my eyes, I, I'm scared to go. Oh wow, you really are very concerned about them. Why don't we go have a look together? If anything bad happens, we'll help you out. There's no point in worrying too much. You're right, let's go together. With the two of you to help me, I feel like we can handle this. Keep up. <laughs> Can't see. Oh, my precious flowers. They've been ruined. Oh no, what a pity. So the reason your flowers couldn't grow is because of the damage done by the Breacher Primus? I... I'm going to keep watch next to my flowers from now on. I'm never leaving again. Wait, come down for a second. Casa... No, Casa... Casa... Zena. Let's think of another solution first. Or together. First off, why do the Breacher Primus damage your flower garden? When you brought the other flowers back before, did any Breacher Primuses come after you? No, never. Huh, that bad guy would only dare do such things behind my back. Oh, now I'm really mad. Wow, uh, Pama didn't expect Kasan Sana could, get, could also get so angry. Guess she really does care a lot about these flowers. But thinking back for a moment, it's not like the Primuses ran away when she got close. Perhaps it's not the flowers that are attracting them. That's possible. Let's check the area around the garden and see what we can find. Okay. I hear everything! Awesome, Traveler. You turned that ugly machine to beautiful components. Kaboom! Kabam! Just like that. Well, it won't be troubling this garden again. Some of the flowers have been damaged, but the rest still look like they're in good shape. There shouldn't be any Breacher Primuses coming around to trouble your garden again, so your flower can now grow strong and healthy. This is great. Still, I've learned my lesson. Such precious flowers require attentive care and diligent protection. Traveler, Paimon... You've brought me such exotic flowers, and you've even helped me defend my garden. How can I ever repay you? Uh, no need to do to be so polite about it. Ah, yes, I know. I picked these flowers myself. They're very precious to me. Can I give them to you? Huh. Um, if these flowers really are that precious, then you should probably start your own garden to plant them in, traveler. Speaking of which, uh, aren't these Tegelga? Do they really count as flowers? Tedga, Tedla, Tedal, Tidalga are plants and they are very beautiful, so of course they're flowers. This is what humans call biology. I spent some time studying it so that I can become a great florist in the future. Hee hee hee. Paimon feels like there's something kind of off about this, but it's not like Paimon knows too much about plant tax taxonomy any either. I'll continue to work hard towards my goal. I have heard humans say that excellent florists are able to breed new types of flowers, which they then bring to horticultural fairs. I want to do that too, and I want to win awards there. Well, that's very commendable and everything, but Pamela feels like there are still some misunderstandings here that will be hard to explain. Her purpose for taking part in a horticultural fair is to show off the new variants of plants she's managed to let 
made and let humans appreciate them, right? Thing is, her sense of aesthetics might be a bit too different from those of humans. You think they might find the flowers she breathes weird? You're rather invested in her horticultural career, I see. Of course. Paimon's her teacher, you know. If she wins, Paimon will look good, too. There's no need to be too obsessed with winning awards. The most important thing is to be happy with your work. That's true. The only person who needs to find the flowers you raise beautiful is you. You don't have to worry too much about what other people think. You just need to take care of your garden, wash the lovely flowers, and be happy every day. Yes, I'll make sure that make sure they grow healthy and strong. And I forgot to look at the name of this quest, and this is probably the end of it. And it is... Were It So Easy. I guess that's the name of it. Alright. So that's going to be it for that. And I'll see you guys later.